intellectual class of municipal corporation of greater mumbai education department i am mrs akshata kale and today we will learn maths okay now we will move to the chapter let me welcome all of you for maths class of standard 1st and today's topic is addition by counting forward dear children today we are going to learn addition see this is the symbol for addition that is one horizontal line and one vertical line they are crossing in between okay this is our symbol for plus or addition okay here we are going to learn addition by counting forward method there are so many methods are there there are so many methods today we are going to learn by counting forward method okay see dear children first we will try to understand the meaning of counting forward means here forward what is the meaning of forward see this girl is going forward see okay this is forward action moving ahead okay this is called forward action here counting forward means we are counting the numbers in forward direction you know the serial numbers 1 to 100 and more than that right yes one comes first then comes 2 3 4 5 like that these are in forward directions okay before that see this this is one finger one number right two fingers three fingers four fingers five fingers you know this right by using these fingers we will try to learn addition by counting forward method okay see this here our first sum three fingers plus four fingers is equal to how many fingers yes here you can see three fingers right plus four fingers together make means this is nothing but addition addition means counting together okay now we will take these two pictures again here this is three fingers along with four fingers now in the first one we will count these fingers okay one two three you know this three fingers now what we will do we will count forward see this is fourth after three comes four right so fourth this is fifth next finger next is sixth and last one that is seventh finger yes what we did we counted in forward direction after three we counted four numbers right and we got the last number seven so seven is our answer got this three fingers plus four fingers together give us seven fingers for the children okay some more examples we will go through okay second one four fingers plus five fingers is equal to how many fingers now here are our four fingers plus five fingers again we will join them together see this is five i will take in first position then i will take four it becomes very easy to calculate okay this is 1 2 3 4 5 you know this right five fingers one hand has five fingers now here we are going to add four more fingers so what we will do we will take the next number we will count in forward direction for the four fingers okay after five comes six this is seven this is eight 
This is nine. Yes. All together there are nine fingers. Got this children? What we did? We counted in forward direction to get our answer. Right? See one more here. Five fingers plus five fingers is equal to how many fingers? Here are our five fingers of one hand and this is five fingers of other hand. Okay? Two hands. Now together you know the answer, right? Both together our hands have ten fingers, correct? These are five, that is one, two, three, four, five. Next number comes is six, seven, eight. 8, 9 and 10. You know the answer, right? So, 5 fingers plus 5 fingers gives us 10 fingers. Okay? This is known as counting forward method. What we are doing here? We are doing addition. Right? Okay. Now, dear children, here you can see numbers 1 to 10. Right? We will use these numbers to get our answer. See here. 3 stars plus 2 stars is equal to how much? Okay. Now 3 stars. This is earlier. So 3 we have encircled. Now after that we have to add 2 more stars. 2 stars are there. So we will count forward in 2 steps. Okay. 2 steps we will move forward. See, this is one step, one number. This is second step, second number. What we got? We got number five. So, our answer is five. Got this? Means what we did earlier, we have three stars. We added two more. So, we counted two numbers in forward direction. That is nothing but four and five. And 5 is our last number. So, that is our answer. For this. Here. Add. 4. Plus. 4. Is equal to how much? You can see 4 gems. Again 4 gems. Okay. These are 4 gems you know. Right. Because it is given 4. Okay, now what we will do? We will count forward. After 4 comes, this will become 5th one, right? This will become 6th. This is 7th. This is 8th, right? So, all together we got 8 gems. So, our answer is how much? 8, isn't it? So, let us write here 8. That is 4 plus 4 gives us 8. Got? Here one more. 6 plus 4 is equal to how much? Here you can see 6 flowers, golden flowers. And here 4 flowers. Right? Now, here earlier there are 6. So, let us take them down. They are 6 in number. Now, we are going to add. So, we will count 4 numbers in forward direction. Right? We will take these 2 down. Yes. This is 6. Correct? This is 7 and 8. Right? Next are 9 and 10. Got this? So, all together there are 10 flowers. Right? So, 6 plus 4 is equal to 10. Got this children? This method is called as Yeah? Counting forward method. Very good. Next here in vertical position 5 plus 3. Let us write here 1 to 10 numbers. We will use these 1 to 10 numbers to get our answer. See 5 
प्लस थ्री इज इक्वल टू हाउ मच ओके वेर इज अवर फाय हिट इज सो लेट एस एन सर्कल दिस फाय देन वी वॉन्ट टू एड थ्री नंबर्स राइट सो वी विल मूव थ्री नंबर इन फॉरवर्ड डिरेक्शन फ्रॉम फाय दिस इज वन नंबर दिस इज सेकेंड नंबर दिस इज थर्ड नंबर एंड we reached to 8 so this is our answer got this yes we wanted to add 3 to 5 so we counted three numbers in forward direction and we got our answer okay next 4 plus 4 again let us write here 1 to 10 numbers Okay, and our number is four. So let us encircle this four. Then we have to move four numbers in forward direction. So this is one number, two, three, and four. Right? Fourth number is nothing but eight. That is our answer. What is that? Four plus four is equal to eight. you can follow this method also by writing numbers now 14 plus 4 again let us write 1 to 10 and 11 to 20 okay now you know that 14 is earlier there so let us encircle this 14 first how many steps you have to go in forward direction four steps okay one Two, three, and four. Over eighteen, we reached to eighteen. So eighteen is our answer, right? Okay. Here sixteen plus four. Again, let us write one to ten and eleven to twenty. Yes, what to encircle now? Which number? Yes, very nice. Sixteen. Okay. Then how many steps you have to count in forward direction? Four. Nice. From sixteen, this is first. This is second number. Third number. Fourth number. We reached to twenty. So twenty is our answer. So sixteen plus four is equal to twenty. Yes, we are getting the answers by using addition by counting forward method. Here, thirteen plus three is equal to how much? Okay, first let us write numbers. Thirteen, thirteen. We already have, right? So thirteen. Then how many steps we have to count in forward direction? Three numbers. Thirteen plus three. So after thirteen comes fourteen, right? This is first number. This is second number. This is third number. What we got? We got sixteen. Correct. Sixteen is our answer. Okay, one more. Now sixteen plus four is equal to how much? Let us write the next number sixteen. Okay, okay, sixteen already we have plus we have to add four plus four we must do. So after sixteen, four numbers. This is seventeen. One number eighteen. Second number. Nineteen third number and twenty fourth number is over. We got twenty as our answer because we counted four numbers in forward direction. As we want to add four numbers to sixteen. Yes, got the method. Very nice, dear children. Here are some sums. 
okay we will not write here 1 to 10 or 10 to 20 we don't write we try to take our fingers and we will try to count and get the answer 12 take five fingers on your hands okay and try to count five numbers in forward direction from 12 12 already is there okay so 13 fold your fingers 14 15 16 17 right we have folded five fingers so we got the answer 17 yes now 6 we have already right again you take five fingers now let us count in forward direction okay after six first finger that is seven eight nine ten and eleven our answer must be eleven right next nine okay we have to keep nine in our mind and take six fingers come on after nine we'll count in forward direction okay nine then comes 10 11 12 13 14 and 15 we have counted six numbers and we got 15 as the answer now here again 17 number and five fingers after 17 comes 18 19 20 21 and 22 our answer is 22 here 14 keep this in your mind and take six fingers we'll begin 15 16 17 18 19 and 20 20 is our answer now dear children keep 20 in your mind and take three fingers yes count in forward direction after 20 comes 21 22 23 so our answer is 23 for the children i hope you understood yes this is very very easy method that is counting forward method right okay now dear children add by counting forward one trick i will i want to show you here five plus how much 12 is equal to how much see 5 plus 12 is equal to how much 5 is smaller number and 12 is greater number we cannot take 12 on our fingers then what to do yes ok there is one simple method or one trick is there what you have to do you have to take 12 in the first position ok plus you can take 5 on your fingers like this yes greater number keep in your mind okay always choose the greater number and keep that in your mind and the small numbers you can count in forward direction very easily right okay this is 12 now this is 13 14 15 16 and 17 so we got our answer that is nothing but 17 got this yes but here it will become very difficult 5 plus 12 yeah it is very complicated so please change the order and 12 that is the larger one that you keep in your mind and smaller you can take on your fingers okay this method you try to follow okay now this is from your textbook Okay, this you have to carry out with, with the help of the pencil in your textbook. One I will show you. Here 8 plus 6. So let us write 1 to 15 numbers here. Okay, 8. 
you know that you will encircle it then how many steps you have to move in forward direction six right okay from eight one two three four five six we got 14 number that is our answer yes got this yes if you know how to do then it is not necessary to write the numbers okay you can go directly and you can count in forward direction and you can write the answers here see dear children in the second sum 4 plus 9 yes you can take 9 in your mind and 4 fingers you can use here okay like that here one more page is there okay this is also for this is also from your textbook okay try to solve this also and this is homework for you you know how to do right just now we carried out so many sums of the same kind right correct okay very good thank you dear children children take care and stay safe bye Thank you very much students for being a part of this lesson. Please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get new updated videos.